Hey friends and welcome back to my channel. This video is all about fixing the runtime error. Whenever you launch the application, you got this application has requested the runtime to terminate it in an unusual way, especially either with Logitech or with Ubisoft. So without wasting time, let's go ahead and directly proceed with the resolution. First of all, click on the start menu and type CMD. Run CMD as an administrator. Type here SFC space slash scan now and then hit the enter key. Now wait for the command to finish the scanning and fixing process in your Windows PC. Once it is completed, type in another command DISM space slash online space slash cleanup hyphen image space slash restore health and then hit the enter key. Now again wait for this command also to finish the fixing of corrupted files in your Windows PC. Now once it is completed, close it. Now go ahead, restart your PC and again try to launch the application and check if you are still getting Microsoft Visual C++ runtime error. If this failed to work out, in next step, right click on start menu and choose the option run. Type here, percentage local lab data percentage and then hit the enter key. Over here, you will find a folder with the name Ubisoft Game Launcher. So this error is causing because of the Ubisoft, go ahead, right click and choose the option delete. Simply deleting this folder will fix out the issue of runtime error with Ubisoft Game Launcher. Now if this also failed, let's proceed with the third step. If you have installed this particular and protect online security as well as voice meter, make sure you uninstall both these applications from your system because this is the major cause for Microsoft Visual C++ runtime error. So after installing both the applications from your system will completely fix out the issue of runtime error. The application has requested the runtime to terminate it in an unusual way. If this also failed, in next step, right click on start menu and choose the option device manager. From here scroll down and expand your sound video and game controller. Many users have claimed that disabling the sound has fixed out the issue for them. So right click on each of the sound and choose the option disable device. One by one, you need to disable each devices from the sound video and game controller and after disabling each device, go ahead and relaunch the game to fix out Microsoft Visual C++ runtime error. Now the issue is with the Logitech, let's proceed with the resolution. Open up your web browser and here I have Microsoft Visual C++ all versions. Scroll down and you need to download its latest version. Go ahead, again scroll down and download this 64-bit version into your system. Save it in your PC. In the meantime, right click on start menu and choose option run. Type here appvis.cpl and then hit the enter key. Now in order to install the latest Microsoft Visual C++ versions, first of all, you need to delete each and every version available right over here. Simply select and choose the option uninstall. Make sure you uninstall each and every version available over here of Microsoft Visual C++. After uninstalling, run this downloaded application in your system. Simply proceed with the on-screen instructions. After installing, your PC will restart automatically. After restarting, click on the start menu and type CMD. Run CMD as an administrator. Now in command prompt, I have two commands. Copy the command from the description of this video and you need to paste right in command prompt by pressing the control plus V key. Then hit the enter key. The error is showing because I have already deleted this particular file. Now again, copy the second command from the description, right click and choose the option copy. Now paste right over here and then hit the enter key. Now this will completely delete the set point file which is giving you the error of runtime in Microsoft Visual C++. This is how you will be able to fix Logitech error of set point in Microsoft Visual C++. So as of now, this is all about it friends. If this video works out for you, I request you to please click on the subscribe button and turn on the bell notification icon to continue receiving updates from my channel. Thank you so much friends. Thank you for watching.